which led to the tethering of the skin tissue. So, uh, so tethering of the skin, which gave a very unsteady frontal appearance. The patient was taken up for uh, this is, uh, after the surgery. Surgical care, patient was taken up for the surgery. 3D printing of the implant was done after the virtual implant. The defect was exposed. The bone flap was removed, and a peak patient-specific implant was. Used to replace the cranial defect. This is the post-op profile and radiograph. We can able to appreciate the radio velocity, radio lucency is because of the peak implant. And in this photograph, you can even able to appreciate the contour deformity which has been corrected following the peak implant. I like to present the next patient is a.